Right, now I can't even remember where Malek's Cross is. Uh, let's have a look at the map. There's Egli. Ah, Malek's Cross. Okay. Now, hopefully, hopefully, uh, I'm going to go southeast. Hopefully, we killed everybody off in Chapter 2. All the people who might try and kill us. So let's just follow this. That's it. And we'll have a, a pretty long but uneventful uh, journey. The road at east. We'll pass through Malik's Cross or Sethanon if we head this way. Well, yeah. Yeah, let's go there. Uh, okay. The landscape flattened. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Funny how it was sort of, sort of getting dark before, you know, before we went into that um, long wherever it is we've just been. We've come out the other side. It's still getting dark. Isn't that amazing? Let's rest. Oh, Gareth's getting a bit low on rations. We'll have to get Owen to split his, uh, you know, to share. Uh, but no, I didn't want to do that. I did not want to do that. Shall we save again? Just for the hell of it. Yeah. Just so we can hear the music. Now then, where are we? We have obviously been here before. Ooh, a shop. Shops that sell things. I know that uh, revelation is going to shock you, but uh, I have noticed it. Should we buy some rations and give them to Gorath? Might as well, yeah. So, what else have you got? Ooh, oh, what could we buy? Me. It's all very well having these these books for sale, but they don't actually tell you what it is they're training up, which is a, a bit of a shame, really. And this one is definitely defence, because uh, it's the Psalms of Dala, and that, I think, goes with Dala Tail Milk. This is something... Ah, oh, this is something to do with armour and weapons. Yeah. Shall we? No, we've got all this gold. We might as well. Okay, so we'll take that. You carry it. Yeah. And, uh... Bird migrations, what on earth could this be? I don't know. Uh, mm, and we will use that at some point. Just spend a month reading that book. Uh, I wonder if anything much has changed in here. Since the last time we passed through... Apparently not. Oh, a shovel. We've got a shovel. There's an inn! Uh, if you've got any... You. There. You are following us. Don't think I don't know. You Everywhere we go, you're there. Every inn we step into, you are there. In the same clothes, in the same wig, with the same beard, looking just like King Charles. There's something going on here. I know it. I'm watching you. She hasn't got any restoratives. Let's bard. 62! No, we can't really talk to anyone. Uh, I'm not talking to him. The party's abilities have increased. That must be our barding ability. Uh, hmm. Hello, knock, knock, knock. Uh, oh, yeah. Door slammed in our face. The place is abandoned, yeah, and there's nothing here because whatever the, the was we took last time. Now then. Let's just, uh, where are we? Next next stop, Malik's Cross. Right, okay. Uh... Now I'm hoping we're going to run in, run into somebody before we get to Malik's Cross. 
Somebody will give us a... Ah. A woman was moving down the road, uh, judging by her pace and the way she was looking over her shoulder. She seemed to be concerned that someone might be pursuing her, afraid that the woman might be in danger of some harm. Owen called her. Oi, Mrs. What? Who the hell? I've seen you. We've seen you before. I know we've spoken to you before. We definitely have. What are you doing on this road? You're not thinking of going to Malek's Cross, are you? Well, actually, uh, the abbot of the uh, Abbey Ishaps. What? Betrayed his students and his town, and is be and it's besieged by some kind of monsters. I should have known that I couldn't escape the evil that brought down Sethanon. Oh, you're the one who told us about Sethanon, and likely our elf friend here had something to do with it. That's a bit racist. Be ashamed of yourself, you daft old crone. Gareth has nothing to do with it, I assure you. What are these monsters, and why would they be attacking Malik's Cross of all places? If you value your lives, you'll help the villagers find the abbot and deliver his head on a stake to those snake men. They promise to leave everyone else alive if the abbot is turned over to them. If these are indeed some kind of monsters, what makes you think that they'll be satisfied with killing an abbot? Who's for knowing? As for my own self, I'll be in Darkmoor drinking up the... Oh my, I've left my ale in the Queen's Row in Malik's Cross. Now I'll have none of the brew... No, no, no. Now, I, now I'll have none of the brew for weeks, unless... Unless you brave, you courageous boys can go and fetch it for me. We have quite a few other things to attend to. Oh please, it'll brighten up an old missus's day. Especially one that hasn't had a good... Hasn't, had, hasn't a good home anymore. If you get it, you can come and bring it to my friend Ulam's house in Darkmoor. That's where I'll be staying for a bit. I will see what we can do, but I can't promise you anything. Mm -hmm. That's fine, love. Just fine. She's from Yorkshire. Because in Yorkshire, everybody calls everybody else love. Uh, that is, uh, yeah. That is a fact for all you people who are not from Yorkshire. If you ever come to Yorkshire, just go into the shop and say, uh, I'll, have, I'll, have, I'll have that fine pasty you've got there. Cheese and onion, please. Love. And that's it. When you see people in the street, you say, hello, love. Opposite sex only, obviously, unless you want to get arrested or hit or something. But, you know, um, yeah, that, that's how you get by in Yorkshire. If you need any more travel advice, just let me know. Anyway, uh, I remember that my friend's name is Ula. I'm good travelling to use. Yeah, and to you as well. Be careful on your way to Darkmoor. Right, so, uh, yeah, what's going on at Malik's Cross then? Right. So, right. Okay, but I think we're going to get into combat now. Perhaps I should be reading that book we've just bought, I don't know. But if we save there and uh, we're getting into a hopeless situation, we'll just reload and uh, read it and then, yeah. Oh, is this... we're not at Malik's Cross, are we? Do we have to go... the Temple of Ruthia. Hello, I could go and get... Let's go and bless this blade. Gareth's blade, it needs blessing. We've not done this for ages. Oh, do you know what I've forgotten as well? I've forgotten that we could actually teleport from place to place. Uh, to bless. Let's bless. Which of your items would you like blessed today? Well, not any of those items. This one. A priest accepted the item. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bless it, bless it. 775. Good job we can accept that. There we go. We, this sword is now blessed and hopefully we'll... We're done. We're done. We're done. Goodbye. Hello. Yeah, no, that's it. That's it. Okay. Oh, it's got dark now. Let's just get back on the road then and uh, we'll rest. Save. And off we go again. Well, I can't see anyone. Uh, I'm assuming assuming that we're going to have to fight at some point. A little graveyard there. Oh, the enemy approached. Where did they come from? You may get your wish. I should be there. Kill us first. What? Yeah, okay, what are you going to do? There's only... 
two of you. Ooh, ooh. That's nasty. That's victimization. Right. And they're faster than Gareth, so he's never going to be able to catch them. And now it. Right. This is a problem. They can just run away and keep out of his uh, melee range. Oh, he has got a crossbow though, hasn't he? Except he's not very good at using it. 